<laughs> Back to that long run of Butch Wolfolk for a minute. That is a Michigan record, the 92 yards, the old record held by Tom Harmon of 86 yards set back in 1940. And Butch's run today might not have happened because of a little bang to the knee that happened early in the game and forced him to sit down. I, I, got, I got it twisted in the first half. I really don't know what happened to it. I, I got hit from the backside and it twisted, sort of, I think it was on the, a wide sweep play. You spent some time on the sidelines then. Did you think you'd get back in? I knew I'd get back in as soon as I stood up on it. I, I didn't know how the, the seriousness of it, but as soon as I stood on it, it didn't bother me at all, so I knew I was coming back in. And when you got back in, the running was fantastic. It was there. The blocks were there. I read the, I forget what the play was exactly, but I read the backside guard, uh, John R. Business block on the front linebacker. Then I cut off of that, then I cut off another block. I don't know who it came from. It may have been uh, uh, L.P. Reed right here. <laughs> <laughs> and then I cut off of that, then it was just clear sailing all the way. And when I got back to the bench, I heard that uh, one of the defensive backs was chasing me all the way. I didn't, I didn't see that. I couldn't look back. Huh? Are you a different runner than when you came here? I don't see how I've changed at all. No. I use my speed more. Coach uh, Terrell Burton taught me how to use my speed more instead of just, you know, trying to power over people. Feels good to get one under your belt, huh? Yeah, it feels good. It gives us confidence for the next two games coming up. Is he a different runner from the one you saw when you first brought him? Oh, I, I think he is. Uh, he hates to admit, you know, that he's changed, but uh, he, runs, um, he runs with a lot more power now, I think, and uh, he's, um, he's gaining confidence. He's matured as a back. Um, we, we, want him to, um, we want him to be getting those 100-yard games in the next two games, and then we're going to call him a great back. But until he does that, you know, we'll, you know, we'll reserve judgment until he shows in these next two. But I, I think he's really coming along. He's got confidence, and I think our, our team has confidence in him getting yardage for us. How is the knee, or do you have to find out about that earlier in the week? Well, it'll take, you know, earlier in the week to tell on, uh, on both Butch and um, Kurt Greer.